Nate. Does your mom like BBC? Because she sure loves G.I. Joe Blackout. <laughs> that was stupid. Nice. <laughs> Hey, someday if Nate has a, a kid with Jess and like stops being our friend anymore and doing Let's Plays, you can have a baby with Nate's mom and name it Nate, and then it'll be like we have another Nate. In 20 years. Yeah. That makes sense. I would just name my kid Nate. That makes sense. And drop my kid off at with, your house. Yeah. I'm going to sink again on Play Game now that it's in. In three, two, one. Oh, I got it. If you have a seizure, immediately stop the game and consult a doctor. I like the idea that someone's going to have like a seizure and they're going to be like, Bus, keep playing! Imagine being so weak that you get a seizure from a video game. No, that's weak-willed and weak-minded. That is that is beta energy right there. I had a seizure. Jill seizures are not funny. Yeah, they are. Yeah, Jill, I, I like seizures, search Sally. and seizures. I'm more of a fan of French dressing. There's this one time nice. that I'm... You get it? Yeah, I do. <laughs> Wait, Caesar salad? Oh. I was going to say, um, there was this one time in a math class where a teacher put on a video for, like, math, but it flashed too much, and one of the girls in my class had epilepsy, and she had a seizure. That is actually awful. It was I'm really bad. Press X in three, two, one. Why is, like, main schools the most depressing, messed up things in the country? In three, two, one. Everyone was really worried about her, too. Resume she in lived. three, two, one. Okay. Here you go, Jill. Yay! So, yeah, I don't know. Main schools seem like they actively find ways to abuse kids. <laughs> it's like some kind of weird, like, fetish there for the teachers. They're like, how can we trigger a seizure today? Or like, oh, man. I heard this kid has dyslexia. Let's make him read the page with the N-word on it. <laughs> <laughs> they they don't go far enough to kill anyone like your mom's school does so they can still touch the kids. What the heck? That makes sense. Oh, man. Is it kind of weird that like, To Kill a Mockingbird is every English teacher's favorite book? But yeah. all it says is like N word, N word, N word. I know, and they get to like those, like page 174, and every English teacher's like, guys, guys, I got this page. I would make a white kid say it. Why? Because it's funny. Oh, okay. It'd be kind of a gaff. A yeah. goof. Jill, you have to cause property damage, remember? Hit, hit some of these cars. Thank you. Jill, we are destroying. Oh, wow, it's property. really helping, actually. Look at all the money. Destroying Boy, police property is funny. We need three million dollars in, er, in damages by the property end. damage. Yeah. And why would that stop don't don't damage the Ghostbuster mobile or whatever. Damage the Ghostbuster mobile or whatever. What is their car called? The Ghost Mobile. Oh. Or it's called the Ghost Machine. What is it we're actually supposed to do here? It, what if it was called like the Spectre Truck? Okay, Jill, you've had your turn. It's my turn. <laughs> oh, what? Kill those oh, kill those things. Okay. So now, why is like Stave Puffed having weird marshmallow Stave babies? Puffs. And also, why don't I have graham crackers and chocolate? That is a good point. State Puff is like the Chinese version of State Puff who loves the state government. <laughs> He's like, the Chinese government state is amazing. You better be careful what you say about China. Why? I'm LeBron China. will come after you. Okay, Jill, this is a bit of a whole story. Well, I don't know how to go. There's not. I can't run. Oh, okay. So sometimes when you see enemies, we shoot them. Right, but sometimes we don't. It right. depends on who the Ghostbusters deem is a GOC. I'm gonna shoot you. <laughs> I love that term. Well, so why is the Marshmallow guy back? Because the first time it was because Ray thought of something and it was the Marshmallow Man. Ray pissed, yeah. He yeah. Like came in and ruined society with Right, his. right. Oh, and here's some ghosts but you have to ruin. Can you maybe... take a picture of them? See, these are ghosts uh, that you don't try. Take a picture. Nice, good job. Good nice, job. we got Hobo ghosts. Nice. What's wrong with him being homeless? Why is this game offensive towards homeless well, it's, people? Uh, it's illegal to be homeless. I had a teacher once too who told me that hobo was an offensive term. It's she not. called it like a slur. It is not yeah, a slur. Yeah, it's like the n-word for homeless people. It was in fourth grade, by the way. This was before like the, save the feminist movement happened. Oh, wow. This was Bangor. before the n-word was offensive. She was in fourth grade. <laughs> I'm sorry. I died. Before the N-word was offensive. <laughs> Back
Back in my day, we could freely throw around the N word. I had a friend who we his nickname was that. <laughs> it wasn't even was offensive. He? All these modern day oh, snowflakes are ruining the N word for us. <laughs> what if? <laughs> okay, what if the clan? Okay. Started doing social media marketing to make themselves more likable. Okay. And they said that they were reclaiming the word for white people. How for would white that... racists. Oh. Joe, we still need property damage. So I like you it. Shoot the cars while you I like it. Thank you. Would you follow their page? Just to see how insane it was, yes. Okay. But like to agree with it, no. You so you would not be like the administrator. I used no. to um, follow an Instagram page um, that was run by this girl, who no, no, no. She, she was an adult, but she was like in an incestual relationship yep. with her father. Oh no! And her brother and sister were in a relationship together, and she ended up getting pregnant with her father. And like I thought it was really interesting. Isn't that illegal? I'm pretty sure, but I think they were in Alabama. Anyway, eventually I was like, well, you know, if she's pregnant with, with um, her dad's kid, I think I might unfollow now. I've done my research. No, you didn't take it far enough. I would say, when's your dad free this week? I would just say, I need to know what about your dad, what about his DDC, his daddy dick? You need to say Winston. They didn't. They didn't let insiders into. I mean, outsiders into their relationship. They well, thought people good. who that's, weren't in their family were yucky. That right. makes sense. They're like the British royal family. Right. They're also like a modern day a certain group in America that I'm not going to name. Oh. Which group? Feminists. Yeah. Yeah. That's <laughs> what it is. <laughs> So, Jill, we have to capture these ghosts, but you also have to shoot the things out of the air that are being thrown at you, kind of. <clears throat> That's my understanding of what's going on here. These are all the correct type of ghosts to be captured. Right. These are... Well, like, look at look at them. I know. They don't look like ghosts that should be killed. Right. No, so, they look like ghosts to the new, <laughs> According to this racist ghostbuster... Uh, <laughs> not us. Not me. <laughs> What if, like, <laughs> What if, here, put down your trap. Put down a trap. Square, and now pull them into that. What if, like, they're like, I have to wait for hey, it. Hey, the movie made some oh. adjustments to the car, and they go out there, and there's, like, a Confederate battle flag. <laughs> <laughs> there's, like, uh, who hired this guy? <laughs> Let's cut it. Joe, I wanted to let you play this. Part. I got absolutely murdered every time. Yeah. It I didn't, know. I don't know what, what hit me. Uh, they're throwing cars at you. Oh. The, that's why I was telling you that the Stay Pup guy... But I was trying to get the guy in the trap. I know, but you have to kind of do both at the same time. It's not exactly a fair... Um, this is not exactly a fair ask for what to do for, like, the second mission. But Especially when you're a woman. Go shoot the that police is, car. It gets is, you yeah. a lot of money. You're like a... See? Look at all that go up. from 2020. Me? Yeah, when you destroy that police car. In theory, I suppose it's, it's true. Yeah! Right or good person. Well, I'm gonna cut ahead, so that's why I'm just... Did, did you shoot that, that uh, police car in honor of George? Yeah, George of the Jungle? George yeah. Of the, yeah, no, curious George. Do you think there's something to complete the monster thing? There is, yeah, there's a trophy. There is a trophy. I didn't so, what I'm doing is I'm just staying... Peter Bankman's already dead. Oh, we're gonna leave Peter on the ground. That's where he belongs. Oh, Peter's up now. Good. Power's back! He's got cum on his face. Now hold on, Jill. Jill, you can't say that. He did! Okay, press square to put down a trap. I did already. Oh, I'm okay. very dedicated to being woke. Hey, over here. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of this... Okay. Gotta keep him in there. He, like, can float Look, I'm out. trying to do you a favor. Hey, over here. Why? Because he's homeless? <laughs> now you, yeah, now you give him a give home. Him a home. <laughs> this one's a wily one. Come on. There you go. You, oh. What the heck? What was that? That's what happened to me. Why did I get nuked? <laughs> it got like JFK. This is not fair. No, it's not. You keep getting nuked every two seconds. Well, I feel like none of us are good at putting monsters in traps. Is there an upgrade I can get? We already got an upgrade. Fast traps. That's fast? Apparently. No. Apparently. 
It's so annoying I have to keep doing this. I know. Also, I don't understand. So I hit up, right? Right. It doesn't seem like it did anything. I'm in. Like, it's supposed to make the beam less wavy, but it's the same, isn't it? It kind of looks the same. Looks the same to me. Nice, that was a lot of property damage. Why didn't you get any money for that? Because they're talking and it doesn't pop oh, up. Okay. Get the one over there. That police car always gives you a lot of good money. See? That's a good point, Diane. Thanks for doing that. Destroy that graffiti. That'll give you some money. No, no thank you. They'll be like, oh, finally, somebody got rid of the graffiti. Well, that art that's on the wall is not going to matter until the artist dies. That's Banksy. Then it's going to matter. That's Banksy's art. No, like, street artist who's like a big deal to everyone except me. I don't know who Banksy is. They made fun of him in a Spongebob episode once. I don't know if you saw it, but, um... Was it a modern episode? I... Really it, it, it. it might have been, because it was, um... There was this guy who was an artist whose name started with a B. I forget what his, like, joke name was. But he made he made art out of the Krabby Patty and left it on the table. And Squidward, like, almost came when he saw it. He was like, this is an official piece! And then Mr. Krabs started charging people to come in and look at it. I don't think I've seen that episode, actually. It was a good episode. I thought it was funny. Yeah, because I haven't seen... Wait, 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 wait. How crap. I think Spongebob ended up, like, cleaning what? the table and it I made everyone take a mad. I of them. No, you don't you have to. Once, once you do it once, it's fine. Even if you die. <clears throat> yeah, because you have one of the hobo ghosts. Okay, sorry, sorry. Now he's going to throw that, so yeah. dodge that. And then now here comes the homeless ghosts. Alright, now be careful of flying cars. This isn't Harry Potter. If we just, like, kill every homeless person out there, would that solve the You asked this question problem? yesterday. Well, I think I'm, like, delving into some, like, deep fetishes of mine. What?! If you kill all the homeless people, then you have more homeless ghosts. I was one-shotted. By yeah. the way. Yeah. That's what happens, yes. You want me to try? Or do you, do want you wanna? I can try. You certainly can. We've passed this around like a, like a used woman. So I can try. Like any woman, you mean? Yeah, they get passed around. What about nuns? They get passed around too, just, di just in a different way. By just God. Do you think way. the priests like call their peen the priest? I thought the priests um, didn't want nuns. I thought they wanted little boys. That is a good point. But what if the little boy is a nun? Oh, now that's hot. That is pretty hot. If you put a little boy in a nun outfit, like a priest is just gonna jizz his pants right then and there. And now you slam your your hobo into the can. trash can. That's where they love to live. Yeah, it's true. I got one. Nice, pick it up now. Yeah, don't let him escape. Super slam to instantly trap ghosts. That yeah, Winston. Oh no, 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 no. How did that one shot me? No. And he's driving over my head. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> like that's like the ultimate like. Wait, they're gonna pick you up. I don't think it's no, gonna they're not. Winston and Peter are dead. No, it they're says help is on the way. way. Somebody's gonna pick you up, only, see? Yeah, because only Egon's up, and he's so stupid. Oh, that was Peter. E Egon's not even in here. I think Egon's in the bus. I so Winstead needs to come you. over here. Why isn't Winstead just come help? Winston. Winston. Whatever. Why doesn't he just come help me? I don't know. That was he's, your fault, mate. He's like, I'm gonna take on all the ghosts by myself! Is it a racist thing that Overwatch named the gorilla character Winston after the Ghostbuster? <laughs> you know, I think you're onto something. I think you're <laughs> onto something, too, actually. I mean, they also have that cowboy named, like, Jesse something, so... Uh, that's McCree. He's a racist. Jesse McCree, yeah. Yeah, Sorry, they have to change something. his name now because, like... The, the guy that was named after him was actually one of the people who sexually assaulted women. Allegedly. But that doesn't even apply to the cowboy. Nor yeah, but now they have to change his name because it was like named yeah. after him, I guess. Assault doesn't matter at all. I get what you're saying. Okay, what was McCree wearing? I'm just wondering what McCree Don't you mean the... Oh. No, I want to know what McCree was wearing. Like a jacket, some pants, Notice a hat. Notice how when men sexually harass women, if the man is attractive, women are less likely to care or report it. No, seriously think about this, though, for a second. And I'm being actually genuine on this. Have you noticed how 
good looking men. Why are you shaking your head, Joe? Because this is not true for all women. No, it is true for a lot. Good looking men are often able to get away with more. That's true. I mean, yeah, look at that. I agree with that. Like, it'll be like they can be super creepy or whatever, and half of women, or a bunch of people, I should say, are like, oh, that's cute behavior because that guy's hot and I want to bang that guy. Mm -hmm. Like, also notice in in actual romance movies, mm -hmm. this is I know these are movies, but mm -hmm. this is like a cultural depiction, right? It's the same thing where if the man is hot and he's a borderline stalker, half the time the behavior is glorified. Like, oh, it's so cute how into her she, he is. Yeah, mm -hmm. I always thought that was kind of dumb and fucked up. Like, personally, uh, I I would not stand for that kind of weird behavior. Like, I don't want to be stalked. I don't want you to rape me. I don't care if you're the king of England and you're, like, the sexiest man alive. The I'm king good. Of England. Right, but I'm just saying, like, in a lot of those cultural depictions and stuff, like, they will have... I'm not put, I'm not throwing Zac Efron under the bus, but he's, like, the most attractive guy I can think of. He well, is What about high. me? What about me? Uh, Nate. No, if they have, like, a Zac Efron-like guy, and he is stalkerish, but he has a good heart, and he just wants to end up with that girl... Yeah. It's okay. Yep. That's kind of the idea. But if he's ugly or fat... Then it's weird. Then it's weird, then yeah. it's weird and he's evil. Yeah, I think that's kind of prejudiced, prejudiced in a way. It's just kind of weird. I don't think that behavior should be considered okay for anyone. Like, just act normal. Yes, yeah, so I, I have a, I have a two-pronged way to think about this. I think that there are certain behaviors that are okay, that people think are not. Like, for example, I think flirting mm -hmm. is fine. Yeah, flirting right? shouldn't be considered creepy. It ends where a woman says, you are really bothering me and you need to stop. Yeah. yeah. To me, but but the idea of, like, the woman needs to initiate everything, I also think is, one, sexist, and two, an unfair position to also put women in. Right. But Either also, one should be able to initiate flirting. It's just if someone says, no, stop, I don't consent to this behavior, that to me is where it's like, you gotta stop. But well, also, then, if, then, if the woman's not hot, then the guy thinks she's being creepy, too, because that's right, happening. that to happens, me. too. Yeah, you're right, you're right, especially in high school. We're like, have you noticed that too? Like, there, there was a girl that went to our high school. I'm thinking of the one who used to wear, like, the frog hat and sometimes had a tail. At our high school? Yes. In my grade. In your grade. Who married multiple men now? Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. But, but when she would flirt with someone, she was actually a nice girl. Yeah. I'm, I'm not, I didn't find her attractive, the person I'm talking about. Right. But she was a nice girl. Right. But when she would flirt with people, people said, she's a creep. But, like, if a preppy girl did it, mm -hmm. people were like, that's hot. I'm gonna, you know. How did I get one shot? Yeah, and Someone that's, give me that's up. wrong. It's really mean. Oh, okay. nice. Like, you don't have to be into a person, and you can ask them to stop. Right. Fine with that. No problem. But you shouldn't call it creepy. It's like a normal thing for people to want to come up to you and talk to you and possibly flirt with you. Yes. Like, that's just, like, a normal thing in the human race. It shouldn't be considered creepy unless... Unless somebody's, yep. like, actually making it weird, like, trying to touch you in places that you don't want to be touched and such right, like that. Unless they're related to you, that's okay. And, like, saying, um, like, I'm gonna follow you home. Right. Again, unless they're related to you, that's okay. Yeah. Well, if they're hot, then it's okay. Well, yeah, no, I'm, I, but I was being serious about that. I'm not saying, like, I think it's okay if someone's attractive. Well, but yeah, no. It it's... even goes for us. Like, if you think about it, Nate, if, there, if we were in college and right. there was, like, a girl who you considered to be just the prettiest person in the world. Right. And she, I know this is creepy, but let's say she told you, like, I'm horny, want to hook up. Uh -huh. You know, that might be considered less creepy and weird to you than if someone you found unattractive did that. Right. Or if she, like, left a bouquet of flowers outside your dorm room, hey, and you're like, how did she figure out where I live? <laughs> yeah. You, you would care it, less. My thing! Yes, yeah. You would care less because she was hot. Right. Um, than if she wasn't. You know, I, I just find that odd. <clears throat> Not you personally, but anyway. Right. Yeah, I just, I don't think it should be... Over here. A lot of those things I don't think should be considered super weird unless it's oversteps boundaries. Right. And I also don't think people should be so mean about other people's looks. Because, like, 
you know, you think that I'm pretty, but there was a lot of people in my school who didn't like me and thought that I was really ugly and, like, uh, would call me names behind my back and, like, I would have crushes on people sometimes, like, as a normal girl does, and I tried to talk to them and they'd just, like, be mean to me, so I never really dated anyone in high school for the most part. Right. Well, then that's what I'm getting to with all this, is I find it weird how those expectations are different depending on who it is. And I think it is that way for everyone. Right. Well, and, and I think I think it just comes down to people want hot people. Right. So, therefore, they're willing to put up with more because the person's hot. Which right. is not okay. Well, I'm my, just saying. Even if you were just mean about it, fine. I think you're a dick, but fine. But my issue with it is that things go reported officially more often when yes. the person is not attractive. Right. Mm. To me, that's where it's like, really? Like, that's an abuse of the justice system. Yeah, that's really wrong. Because that's kind of like an abortion of justice when you're like... Um, abortion again. I love it. I love abortion. But no, when you're like, hey, you are ugly, therefore your stocking is fine and won't be reported. Uh-huh. But you're not ugly, therefore... Oh, take a picture of that guy. Oh, Triangle. I... And then... Nice, I got nice. Him. I got him. I'm trying to get out of this thing. Okay, um, you know, and then... I think you mixed that up, because I, I think you were trying to say, um, if you're not ugly, then it's fine. Your stocking will go right, unreported. Right, right, right. Often. Yeah. Because yeah. you at first said... If you are ugly, then it's fine. Your stocking will go unreported. Well, I was paying attention to Nate, you know, going after the crispy flakes monsters here. The crispy. <laughs> but no, yeah, I, oh. that's that's kind of what I was trying. Oh, take a picture of that. That's a different guy. He's got a gun. What kind of oh. ghost is a gun? He's a construction worker. Oh, that's <laughs> He's just going around like a like a little um, safety coat. <laughs> Yeah, no, I don't know. That was not to make that all like super serious. I just find it interesting. What? Oh, I, I didn't die. Nice. Move, 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 move. I need to get out of here. 